Atlanta's only hip-hop station, Hot 107.9 Jazz and McBeat. Ladies, you already see, I know you're jealous right now because right beside me I have the one and only Morris Chestnut. How you doing? How you? I'm good, I'm good. Good. Is this your first time being here at Red? No, 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 no. Um, I'm here a lot. Are you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm here in Atlanta a lot. Well, this is my first time seeing you. Of course, you've done so many things, of course, Not Easily Broken. Right. The Best Man, The Brothers came on the other day. I watched oh, it. I'm okay, like, okay. I love all of your movies. Thank you. And of course, Boys in the Hood. Now, do you think it's kind of awkward that people still refer you as Ricky? No, you brother? know what? You know, the thing about that is it's so, uh, that that movie touched so many people. Mm -hmm. And it's a, it's a classic that they keep running it to this day, like, you know, several times a month. So, um, just to do something that's been that well received and to be, to have that staying power to be around this long, I'm just glad to be associated with something like that. Uh, you're here in town because you have the stage play. Yes. What my husband doesn't know. Yes. Now a lot of times we women, we inquire about this because we really don't know what men want and then when we're finally married, you know, and I know you're a married man. Right. So we women, we're kind of confused about that. Oh, you confused about what? Just like what what do men want? Kind of well, like you guys aren't confused. You yes, guys we know, are. you guys know what you want and that's what it's all about. You know, it's 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 like this. Women know what they want. You know, they see a man, they they want a certain type of man. They they see a man and say, Oh yeah, I like this and I like that, mm -hmm. but this part I'ma change to what I like. And that's where the problem is. Instead of just accepting the brother accepting. for what he is, y'all okay. say, okay, I like the three out of the six. Mm -hmm. The three that I don't like, I'm going to change that to what I do like. And the brother ain't going to change like that. that. Is that's, so that's what true. it is. Yeah. Okay, so that's the tip of the day. Ladies, do not try to change a man. Don't just, change a man. Just accept it, right? Accept the man okay. for what he is. Yeah. All right. So yeah. tell me a little bit about your character. Yeah, you know what? I'm really excited about this play because um, it, it, it's a character that I've never played before. You know, basically, it's a it's kind of like a reverse twist on Fatal Attraction. Um, mm. He comes into the, you know, kind of. I play the plumber. I come to the house to do some work. Um, Michelle Williams from Destiny Child. Mm. She's this. Um, she's the wife of a well-established businessman. Mm. They're living this big house, but. You know, they say if, you know, when you're making money, you ain't got no time. So, right. you know, things happen. I become obsessed with her and then things happen. Also, uh, being an actor and you, you've you broken into the acting business early on. Mm -hmm. um, what type of advice can you give uh, young actors breaking into the acting business? Um, the best advice that I can give that I wish somebody would give it to me a long time ago is really just focus on your craft. Mm -hmm. Especially nowadays with reality TV. Um, people feel that they just need to come to Hollywood and just be different, just be outrageous and obnoxious and they'll get on a reality show and be famous. Um, that's not what it's about. Um, certain people do um, have some success on reality shows, but it's, it's you know, it's it's gone just like 15 that. Minutes, 15 minutes, right? 15 minutes of fame, then it's gone. So just focus on your craft, don't focus on the parties, focus on your craft and, you know, you'll be successful and be around a long time. Are you a... Twitter? I'm not. I'm not because what? I don't. I don't really have that much to say. You know. I, I mean, it's like. I mean, how many times can I say, okay, I'm going to the gym. Okay, I'm going home. I'm going to lunch. Okay, I'm going. But home. you have to say no. where, so the women will come and stalk you. Like, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Right. So but, yeah. So yeah. I, I don't have that much to say. That's mm -hmm. just why I don't do it. I mean, I know it's a huge part, and I know everybody does it. Um, but I, I just don't have that much to say. Okay. So how do you connect with your fans? I come out and do interviews like that. Okay, well, yeah, we'll that's see. Right. That's you know, good. There so it is, right? We, this should, is we social. should see more, right? This is, we should, right? This see, is social, we should right? see more of that. So, okay. All right. when is the next time should we expect you on the big screen? Um, there, There's a very important movie. There's a movie that I've done in the past. I can't say too much about it, but there's a movie that I've done in the past mm -hmm. that we're probably going to be doing a sequel to next year. It'll probably be out at the end of next year. That's all I can Ooh, say. Is it Boys and Ass? I can't Boys say, oh, man, I can't say what it is. I can't say what it is, but okay. there's something that's going to be coming out that everybody will hear about. Okay, cool. How do you feel with you still being the sex symbol for all women? You know, <laughs> you, you know you are still that. You right? know, it's it, it really, I mean, if that's what I am, I, I appreciate that and mm -hmm. I embrace that. But to me, it's never really been about that. Mm -hmm. You know, to me, it's really just about, always been about the work. Okay. I think because it's another mistake that I feel people make when they come to um, when they come to Hollywood is that they spend more time in the gym than they do working on the craft. Mm. And if it was just about that, I mean, a lot of people have that. Mm -hmm. You have to have that and then some. Mm -hmm. So, um, you know, like I said, I embrace it, I appreciate it and all that, but it's not, never really been my focus. Okay, love the humility. So, thank you so much, uh, Mr. Chestnut, thank for you so coming much. by. Thank we you. do appreciate it. What's up? Your boy, Morris Chestnut. <laughs> Shout out to HotspotATL.com. Check it out. Check the play out. Check the play out. We out. 
what my husband doesn't know. 